Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make dripping text effect in Photoshop using a few simple techniques. Before we start, I would like to recommend you Envato Elements. Here you will find textures, actions and anything else you may need for your future design projects. For example, this amazing wet paint Photoshop effect, which will convert your image or text into a beautiful artwork in a few simple clicks. Open the image from the tutorial assets and hit shift ctrl x Use a big brush with about 900 pixel size and 100% of pressure and create a dripping texture with long and large strokes. Now we need to save the texture as PSD file. Let's create a new document with Ctrl N case combination and add any text you want to use. After that, create a copy of your text with Ctrl J case combination and then select the first text layer in the layers panel. Go to Filter, Distort, Displacement Map and set the horizontal scale to 0 and the vertical scale to 50. Then hit OK and select the texture we have created. This is how our text should look now. Now we need to make our text look softer. Go to Filter, Noise, Median and set the radius to 12. After that, just move this layer down a bit. And finally, to make it look 3D, let's group the layers and add bevel and emboss to this group with the settings which you can see on the screen. And here's what it looks like now. If you want to create a more precise dripping effect, we can use Liquify tool. Create a new text layer and then press shift ctrl x. Set the size to about 70 pixels and pressure to 100%. Start creating drip elements using Forward Warp tool. Make the bottom elements of your dripping worst larger and then make middle elements thinner to make it look like a drop. Feel free to experiment and create different types of dripping elements. Make the lines of your letters less straight using the same forward warp tool. Add the same effects to all the remaining letters. Now let's apply some more dripping elements using our free brushes. Create a new layer below the text and add brush strokes with the same color as our text. Now I would like to show you how to add a blood effect to your dripping text. Let's add a bevel and emboss layer style with the settings which appears on the screen. Put a tick on contour and then add a pattern from our asset and set the scale to 150 and depth to minus 2. After that add the settings which you can see on the screen now. Let's go to File, Place and put a background from the tutorial assets below our dripping text. And finally, if you would like to make the entire effect a bit smoother, you can right click on the group of layers and select Convert to Smart Object. Then add a Median filter with radius set to 6 pixels. Here is our final result. Today you have learned how to make text dripping effect using simple and effective techniques. Thank you for watching and don't forget to check our channel for more useful tutorials.